talk it up real. Hey y'all, it's Shay Bay. Shay or whatever y'all want me to be that day. Um, I'm back with another video. I didn't really have no topics in mind. And Yugi, you knock over my wig, you gonna wear it. He got himself a haircut, so he don't know how to act. I'm going to be doing just my everyday makeup or whatever. I'm going to run errands in a little bit. So I was like, hey, I got all this makeup. I might as well use it. I'm. This is not like no kind of weird medical instrument or nothing. My eyes puff. Like they like to puff early, early, early in the morning. What I do is I got this from Dollar Tree. I put this in the in the microwave. I put this in the the refrigerator, and then I just do this. I know I look like half dead. Truth be told, I am. I stayed up last night, like watching The Office. You know just procrastinating on youtube watching my favorite let's play channels does anybody watch let's play channels like to be honest before i did this youtube shit i did like gameplay videos like and, I, and that channel is still up if y'all want to check it out i'll leave the link below um, i've already moisturized my face i'm really just going to put the camera even closer talk about no boundaries so I put this, basically what I do is I put this um, whitening eye cream. It's, a, it's Japanese, so girl, don't even let me embarrass myself. Now what I like to do is I like to put this eye cream all over my face because when I did my makeup in the last video, I was watching somebody do their makeup and I was like following, uh, following them and um they use like some kind of shave balm i'm like girl i'm not gonna put pussy protector on my face so i um i really just focused on the after effect of how it did and a lot of shave balm like puts a coating over your skin to protect it and the only product that i have that has that consistency honestly is my eye cream and if you have like if y'all wondering why I don't like do the whole circular thing around my whole face um, I am a fan of Korean skincare if y'all haven't told like can tell by my other 67,000 videos talking about it so with that I kind of just like focused on how they actually put on their products they don't do the circular motion they kind of just sweep they kind of go up and sweep up and sweep up and sweep because that actually um helps your skin fight gravity because gravity naturally pulls it down so when you rubbing and rubbing and rubbing doing all that you're promoting your skin to actually go down and girls the sun changing positions seeing you know as y'all can tell my eyebrows are pretty much thick on its own so what i'll do is brush them out Cause girl these shits be loud and proud let me tell y'all how last time i did my i did my wig right i put on my wig and, and when i was cutting the lace with a razor i cut my eyebrows so i looked like a straight gang member for like two and a half months so uh for my eyebrows when i'm doing an everyday look or when i'm trying to look effortless as you can tell i don't know why i was way to the side like <laughs> Let me put my ass in the middle. So what I like to do is I like, um, I had it in my tart, my tart palette, but my tart palette, you know, I didn't know makeup expired. So I threw the tart palette away because I had it for well over like two and a half, three years. So for my eyebrows, I'm going to use this Profusion palette. It's um, the matte, what I showed y'all in the last video. I'm going to use the shade Fuse. I'm going to use the shade Fuse. And then I'm going to just, you know, coat this thing, coat this little thing right here. Now what I like to do is I'll hit, you know, get the excess product off because I like to look as natural as possible without looking like I had work done, even though girl, it don't sound like a bad idea at this point.
another another combination that I'll usually recommend especially if you're going for the light look this palette in particular because it's so light you know I don't I'm not a fan of that whole reddish look not a fan of her so I mixed I mixed fuse with devious and I'm just gonna go back over my first brow you know just to cancel out that whole reddish shit going on so yeah then I'll do that so yeah these are my brows with no extra work done what I like to do is if I'm really going for that clean crisp you know going to the meat market give me the thick slab of meat cut off all that fat cut to what I like to do is I'll use my LA girl concealer and fun um, I like for my look to be as natural as possible as possible I want to go to this school I don't I don't feel like it like I'm just having one of them days where I just want to be home and be ugly and just do my thing I really do have to revamp like my goal list and all of that good stuff because you know sis um, sis bot school is finishing up which means my schedule is gonna open up which means I need to find other shit to do brows I just God, my face up close I don't know what's going on so what I'll do is I'll just Concentrate. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, next eyebrow, just concentrate. You know what's crazy to me? like my left eyebrow can be so seamless so motherfucking seamless but then when I get to my right eyebrow girl it's like we in a custody battle I don't understand what is going on like I can just do my left my right eye my left eyebrow fucking wonderfully wonderfully and then when it get down to the left, well, get down to the right, girl. I don't know my left or my right. I need to wake up. When it gets down to the left, to my left eyebrow, it's like, girl, the door's open. You know, we here. But to the right, it's like, nah, nigga, you ain't seen your kid in about three, four months. You ain't seeing him today. It's around like 11 o'clock, 12 o'clock. So the sun is shifting positions, which means it's shifting my motherfucking lighting after my brows uh what i like to do is i kind of spot like i'll spot conceal i haven't really been doing that lately because my skin's been pretty okay up until this point so what i'll do is i'll honestly just get this the nyx born to glow it's a naturally radiant foundation and i'm not opposed to it but since my skin is oily i don't think i will purchase this again only because like my skin is oily this is giving you a radiant finish so by the time everything is over and done with girl i look like i've been sweating all day not a fan of that put my foundation if you will over it just to give like a slightly woke look but not woke to the point girl are you going to the Met Gala after you hit Walmart like what is going on so I will blend 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 now what I've noticed the importance in um, actually blending properly is that if you rush the blend game your makeup is not going to look as good as you want it to so as y'all can see this is the end result of that 
I didn't put a lot in the beauty su the beauty supply sponge. Might as well be the beauty the beauty blender or beauty sponge, whatever. It's not. It makes the product lighter already. So with it already being lighter, I don't have to do much. But y'all can see with me putting it over. The NYX is close to my shade. The LA Girl clearly is not. I am not that yellow. So putting those two on and blending it together really give me that like woke but not too woke. Natural but not too natural. Seamless but there's a rip in the middle. You know that kind of finish. So after that I will put it, o put it over my there and I don't set I should set but then my setting my setting spray is fucking dewy too so it's like you know I'm new to this makeup shit so I'm like girl let's not get all this dewy shit you're already dewy as it is without now I'm using an angle brush I'm using the angle brush from the set that I got now I'm using the Milani baked blush and toasted almond because I love their blush and I'm just gonna get a little of a fire from the eyeshadow palette and I'm just gonna mix these two together to give me like girl we are beating the excess off because I'm not trying to come out of here looking like a tangerine so a little smile ew, so. highlight tip on my nose tip on my nose and then I sprayed the brush so tip of my nose give that Rudolph finesse yes the bridge of my nose my old toucan Sam ass nose yes I'm gonna use my fingers because this shit ain't it he must be a communist. And now I'm just going to put on some more chapstick because I don't know what the fuck. My eyebrows look, my lips were so dry. I don't put on lip liner when I'm going places regularly. I usually just stick to a nice gloss. I bought this gloss from Ruby Kisses or well, the beauty supply store. It's Ruby Kisses Jelly Licit Jelly Licious uh, Crushed Strawberries. It's a nice pink, so I'll just be putting that on next. <laughs> By the time I'm done, Senpai gonna pay my water bill. <laughs> my lashes. This is from my personal collection. If y'all like it, you know, your girl is on her way to selling them. Stay tuned. Don't want to give too much. Now, the glue that I use, it's, you know, fuck it. It's a lot of controversy around it. But this is what's worked for me. I don't like using the other brand. I'm not going to say who. But I use, um, I use, honestly, bonding glue on the band, the bond of my eyelash and then I will put the bobby pin on top of the bonding glue because nobody wants that shit everywhere blow it a little bit I like this because honestly I say honestly a lot I like this because you know it dries fast just a second it's quicker and it starts off black the other brand I don't like it because I don't feel like it's that I just don't feel like it's that great honestly I don't feel like it holds I don't feel like it's enough product I don't feel like it's good for like people whose eyes water my eyes water a whole lot and it's just not something that I saw myself when I first first started yeah I um, used the other brand of glue but as I got more comfortable with it and then I started actually putting into perspective how many layers I was actually putting on of that shit 
just for it to willow and dangle by the end of the day i was like no i don't want to waste my money just not have my life be that complicated like it ain't already complicated all right all right just put a little more on my nose smooth out the edges i like that you know that glow this is the finished look nothing like too over the top I'll be perfectly honest with y'all, like when I was doing like my highlight or whatever, and then like my phone had died, so I get up and put it on a charger, like I was starting to change my mind with like the whole look. So this is um the look after girl, if I knock this damn tripod over. This is my look um after everything is finished. I did honestly I did um my freckles or whatever. I did it with my LA girl like um concealer in mahogany it literally like i use that as my contour but i was like girl i'm not finna run to the beauty supply store and spend no more money like i'm just finna to use what i got so i use what i got and i use that as my freckles i um line my lips with like some eyebrow pencil or whatever i'm not a huge huge fan but i did line my lips with an eyebrow pencil and I use the Ruby Kisses for the gloss. So this is the finished look. I hope y'all like it. Straight dog penis camera. I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, y'all have a good day. Bye.